Hi, today we are back with a very short tutorial, a very interesting one. We want to put a network speed in the taskbar. In case maybe we need to monitor our speed or know when our bandwidth is being utilized by any software in our PC, we can be able to tell. So this software is one of the best, especially on Windows 11, which has so many limitations when it comes to the utilization of the taskbar. So without many stories, we'll go directly to the website and uh, I will link it in the description box. So this is the website we are going to go to to get our tool. It's an open source tool and uh, it's free for everyone and it has so many features as you are going to see. So once you open this page, you go directly to the releases. This user has uh, released 22 versions so far and uh, we are interested in the latest version, so we click on version 1.83 and then this is the page that you are going to get and these are the assets that we require. So we have all these options, we can even get the source codes to the whole application. Choose the first one, this is traffic monitor version 1.83, 64-bit version. In case you need a 32-bit version, you can use these other options here. And if you need a source code, you can just pick one of these two files. So today we need traffic monitor. Click on it, then we download. It's a zip file. So we go to our downloads. This is where our software is. So once you extract the file, this is what you're going to get. Uh, we open the folder and uh, we have the software traffic monitor.exe. This is the file that we are going to execute. Double click on it, we'll get uh, an admin notification. So you accept, and now the software is running. But we want to put some settings which will help us do exactly what we want. In the icon tray, you right click on the icon, the traffic monitor icon, we right click on it, and uh, we want it to show up in the taskbar window. Once we click it, it will show up here. If we want maybe to make other settings, we go to options after right clicking on that on that same icon. So we can decide to change the font, the text color. I don't like it checking for updates every time I restart my machine, so I leave that unchecked. And uh, you can let it auto run when the window starts. And uh, basically that's it. If you have all the settings set like that, it should appear exactly like mine. So we want to save uh, the data to the program directorate and we click on apply and then OK. And uh, we good to go. But one other thing, sometimes uh, you might find uh, this window, a floating window, uh, which you might like, but in my case, I don't like it. So I uh, just like click on it and then show main window, you uncheck, it will disappear so that you are just left with this monitor, which is on the taskbar. Yeah, that's it. That was um, a short tutorial. I hope it was helpful. And if it was, like our video and uh, give us a subscription. You can uh, as well go down there and comment the next tutorial you'd like me to do for you. That's where I usually pick most of my videos from. Thank you and see you in the next one.